Today we're going to learn about Dale Chihuly. We'll visit his studio and learn about why he creates art. We'll see different kinds of glass sculptures being made, including macchia bowls. Macchia means spot in Italian. We'll also do some drawings of macchia bowls using lines and shapes. This is Dale Chihuly. He was born on September 20th, 1941, and he's still alive today. He's an American glass sculptor and entrepreneur. Dale Chihuly is from Tacoma, Washington. And as you can see, he wears a very special eye patch because he was in a car accident and is now blind in his left eye. Mr. Chihuly did not let his injury stop him from creating amazing works of art and from traveling all over the world to learn about his style of glass creating. Mr. Chihuly co-founded the Pilchuck Glass School near Stanwood, Washington to allow artists the opportunity to work with glass. Oftentimes, he would paint with unusual materials to get his ideas on paper. This is a photo of all of the colors of glass that Mr. Chihuly could choose from in his studio. Artists use a glass furnace to heat up glass to over a thousand degrees and they would pick it up on a metal rod like this. Air is added to the piece of glass through the long metal pipe that it's attached to. This is called glass blowing. Then the molten glass would be rolled onto other bits of glass to create color layers. Artists in the glass studio work together to roll and form and shape the different pieces of glass. Glass blowing can be dangerous so people work together to stay safe and make amazing pieces of art. Dale Chihuly, with the help of his assistants, worked together to create large pieces of glass on the end of the metal rod for forming and shaping. The pieces can weigh over 15 pounds a piece, and even larger pieces can weigh more than that. Here, Mr. Chihuly uses wooden paddles soaked in water to form the glass. Assistants pull and stretch the glass until it's in the shape that they want. When the piece is completed, they put it in a special kiln to stay warm as it slowly cools down, so it will not break. Many pieces of glass were combined together to create this stunning scene out in a courtyard. Oftentimes, Mr. Chihuly would combine individual pieces to create a chandelier or hanging light. Dale Chihuly's art is exhibited all over the world and the United States. He especially likes to put pieces of art in nature scenes that are either hanging from buildings or coming out of the ground, like this sculpture. This style of glass is called a rotolo, which means coil in Italian. Rotolos are very heavy and intricate and also delicate. Each piece takes up as much as 140 pounds of glass and up to 17 people to create. Dale Chihuly also created different styles of bowls and he liked to make bowls that could fit inside of other bowls. This bowl is an example of a macchia, which in Italian means spot. Mr. Chihuly liked to put one color of um, glass on the outside and one color of glass on the inside, and then another color of glass around the rim. I woke up one morning with the idea that 
that I would work with all 300 colors that were available to us. That we we bought these color rods from Germany, and so I put one color on the inside, then sort of a, a translucent or opaque white in the middle, and then another color on the outside, and then it'd be a lip wrap color, usually contrasting to the either interior or exterior color. Yes, there is a never-ending potential for color with the Nokia because there are so many different color layers and so many different colors available. We could never exhaust the color possibilities with Nokia. So where can you go to see some of Dale Chihuly's art? Look no farther. Come to the Downers Grove Public Library. If you go into the library's bottom level by the checkout desk, you will find the Ruby Macchia, which is made of reds and oranges. Stop by the Downers Grove Library and take a picture of yourself. Take some time to enjoy this beautiful piece of art.